All right, big story, uh, breaking story that just happened. Um, uh, the uh, um, uh, WNBA uh, star, uh, Brittany uh, Groiner, I think I'm pronouncing it right, uh, was released from Russia, uh, from Russian jail today. She was uh, accused and sentenced, I think, for seven years in jail for, for carrying, uh, for having drugs, marijuana, something like that, on, uh, on her way out of Russia. She claimed uh, she had none of that, that she was being framed. Um, and uh, what we have is a swap, uh, a, a swap one for one with uh, Victor Bout, who is uh, described as the merchant of death, a arms dealer who was uh, captured by the United States and prosecuted and sent to jail for a long, long time um, for illegally uh, selling weapons uh, internationally. Uh, so uh, she's been exchanged for him. Um, I'm not a fan of these kind of exchanges. I, I think this is a really bad idea uh, with, with one caveat. I mean, she, I mean, it's horrible what happened to her. It's horrific. The United States should have done everything in its power to get her out. As long as we have diplomatic relations with Russia, we should utilize that. But the idea of a prison exchange, I think, is horrific. Uh, the, the challenge here is that every time the United States arrests somebody that the Russians want, they will then frame somebody in Russia, some American in Russia, and uh, sentence them to some horrible sentence in jail with the now expectation that the United States will trade for them because the United States cares so much about its citizens. So given this prisoner exchange has happened, and I, I'm happy for Brittany, I'm happy for her family and for, uh, for the WNBA, and I'm happy for her being back uh, and all of that, but the United States should make a, a simple, straightforward declaration, and that is that the United States citizens who travel to the Russia on their own, that the United States is not responsible for their safety in Russia, that they cannot vouch for that safety. I think at the same time, the U.S. should bring back its ambassador and cut off whatever diplomatic ties we have with Russia. I think the United States should basically say Russia is a rogue nation, um, uh, it is, uh, it, it, it is uh, suspected of, of framing U.S. citizens and putting them in jail for the purpose of uh, negotiating, uh, having negotiating chip, and therefore the United States will not be in a, a position to protect its citizens as they travel, travel to Russia. Um, and uh, then, fine, then you do the exchange and it's over, and from now on, Nothing. And uh, from now on, uh, P Russia is a pariah state that it deserves to be. Uh, and from now on, the U.S. has nothing to do with it. And, uh, and until further notice, that is the situation in which we're in. I, I think that's the appropriate thing to do. Encourage uh, American citizens who live in Russia to leave uh, and, um, and encourage U.S. citizens not to go there again. That is the, the only scenario under which I think such a prisoner exchange makes sense, because otherwise, again, every time Russia wants something for the U.S., it just has to arrest a U.S. citizen that happens to be passing through and, and, and uh, trump up charges, send them to jail, and then negotiate a so-called prisoner exchange. Thank you for listening or watching The Iran Brooks Show. If you'd like to support the show, we make it as easy as possible for you to trade with me. You get value from listening. You get value from watching. Show your appreciation. You can do that by going to yourownbookshow.com slash support, by going to Patreon, subscribe star, locals, and just making a appropriate contribution uh, on any one, of those, uh, any one of those channels. Also, if you'd like to see the Your Own Book Show grow, please consider sharing our content and, of course, subscribe press that little bell button right down there on YouTube so that you get an announcement when we go live. And for you, those of you who are already subscribers and those of you who are already supporters of the show, thank you. I very much appreciate it.